Hey, just a quick note before we get started today. I want to thank you all so much for watching these videos. I hope you're enjoying them as much as I am. I thank you all so much for the love and support you've given me. Um, I just recently reached a thousand subscribers on YouTube. It's freaking mind blowing. I could not have done this without you. I am so grateful. Thank you all so much. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into the action. Here we go. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Master Blacksmith. My name is Sir Medieval, and today is a very special day. As you can see, we are not rocking our regular blacksmith apron. No, no, no. We are fully donned in armor. I'll explain why in just a second. But folks, I want to tell you something. I have discovered the secret to wealth in Life is Feudal. You want to know how to get a crap ton of freaking coins at, at your disposal? Just look at this. I have a gold. All right. I have one gold. That was from about, let's say about 30 minutes of uh, work. Okay. L let me tell you what happened. I reached 90 smelting, right? I'm able to recycle uh, recycle tools now and weapons at, as well. It's freaking amazing. You get like two thirds of the, of the iron back in lumps, which is really useful. But uh, I tried smelting some silver ingots because we need that to upgrade the monument. But I was like, you know what? Let me go ahead and see how much these things actually sell for to the trading post. So I went here, I went in the market. I, uh, I went to Ashland Trading Co, right? Hold on one second. Where is it at? Ashland Trading Co. And I'm like, all right, put up for sale. I go down to the silver bars or silver ingots, I'm sorry, and I click it, sell the crown, and we get, yeah, 10 silver, 8 copper per freaking ingot. All right, we have two silver mines, count them, two. Okay, and we have a pyramid of silver up there. So basically, we're rich. <laughs> so they sell for about 10 silver, 8 copper per. Those are the ingots. The bars, about 50 quality bars, sell for about uh, three, four silver ink, silver coins each. And the lumps, about four of those, sell for about uh, one silver coin per. So that's a pretty good freaking return right there. Especially if decent sized claim would only take like one silver a day. That's freaking awesome. So if you guys have anybody going into smelting or anything like that, make sure they get on this. And let me tell you, once we find gold, we're going to hit it rich, okay? I don't even know how much gold gives. But, um, I mean, we're going to have an abundance of it for sure. So gold ingots probably give you like at least 30 to 50 freaking silver coins per. It'd be crazy if they gave more than that. But anyway, folks, the reason we're donned in full armor right now is because we're going to go on a journey. First thing I want to do is take some of these silver coins out because we're going to get ourselves up a personal claim. Let me tell you what we're going to do in just a second here. Now, I have a high quality iron mine, as you may know, and I don't want anybody to be able to just come over here and take my high quality iron away from me, you know? And as you can see, we got Mr. Williams here to help us on this journey. Go ahead and walk on out there, Mr. Williams. It's all you. The floor is yours, sir. So what we're going to do is our hermit cave that's on the coastline, we're going to turn that into a nice fashion, good old fashioned outpost. Mining outpost for the win. So we got some building logs here to help with the journey because we're going to have an actual plaster house going. I need I need to feel a little bit safer now because you never know what's going to happen. Judgment hour is just around the corner again. Yes, folks, they're going to have another judgment hour. You got to prepare for that soon. Hide your, kid, hide your kids, hide your wife. This one might be an actual fully functioning judgment hour, too. So this is going to be a full-on medieval purge. So you want to level your combat stats up, whatever you can do. Okay, make sure you're safe. Make sure you're safe. We got some building logs to build a small, tiny plaster shack. We have enough uh, resources now to, to assist with that. Luckily, we have trees, trees, and more trees. And also, folks, winter is coming, okay? You gotta be safe for winter. So make sure that you harvest all the animals you can, get that thick leather stocked up, make sure you get your crops, make sure you get your trees going, and uh, make sure you get a lot of food stockpiled. That's the most important thing, because crops might not grow in the winter. Trees, I don't think will. They'll be covered in snow, the crops will, so I don't think those will grow for sure. The trees, I don't know about those, but uh, if I had to bet, I'd say they probably won't grow too well. But um, anyway, you will definitely want to make sure you have a lot of food stockpiled. Once winter comes, we'll be fishing, uh, cooking in campfires more than likely, and we'll be uh, trying to survive against this cold. I don't know if they have a weather mechanic where um, you could actually die from freezing, but uh, if they do, then, oh, that'd be crazy. Or if they implement something like that, that'd be nuts. Oh my god, I'm just shuddering at the thought. You remember all those survival games where you have to just survive the cold and you just freeze in less than five minutes in real life? It's nuts, man. It's nuts. Those survival games are no joke. So as long as you stay safe, we'll be all right. But on the bright side, if you get snow in your area, something to take advantage of is you can pick up that snow and make it into snowmen to level your arts skill up. Now, when you get to 45 arts, you can craft a uh, floor lamp. You can, you know, get a 
bunch of little braziers on your wall and make it all look spiffy and be able to see at night because it does get pretty foggy. It's not as bad as when they had the pitch black thing going on, but you know, it's still pretty fog. Still pretty fog. But anyway, folks, we are going to prepare for winter. We're going to get this mining post up. We're going to get it all done. All right. So here we go. I will see you in just well, a Well, hello, everyone. We are back. Welcome. Welcome back. All right. So right now we're building the house. Um, we have that wardrobe over there to store iron inside. This is our iron mine right here. We're going to put a claim down right around here. We're going to get this set up. But I just realized we don't have any plant fibers, so I'm going to have to try to find a high quality aisle over here somewhere. Mr. Victor can see to that. While we're doing that, we're going to see if we can gather some clay. Oh, that's one quality fertile, fertile soil. We don't want to do that. Mm -mm. We have a really high quality one back at base, but it's kind of far away right now. I don't want to run all the way back at the moment. Ooh, 67 quality. This should do. Yeah, here we go. Let's get that for me. All right. While he's doing that, we need to gather some clay. Let's see here. Oh, yeah, I don't have my hammer on me. Okay. So a good thing to do as well is to inspect the ground before you do anything. So before you gather clay or freaking plant fiber, you want to always inspect the ground. I see 64 right here. This is good. If I can't find anything better, I'll go with this one right here. 60. About over here. Let's see. Right where our mine is, pretty much. 53. Okay, I'll get this one right here then. Uh, well, hold on. Just in case, for safe measures. 71. Ooh, see what happens when you explore? That, there we go. That's beautiful. Uh, Mr. Man just needs a shovel. He's got primitive shovels. Here we go. Alright, this is going to work out really nice. And we could terraform the rest of this out later. Because uh, from where the house is, it shouldn't interfere with these tiles down here. I really hope it doesn't. That way we can flatten out the rest of this and uh, have a little lawn down in front. See here. Okay. We're going to gather some of that. So this this mining outpost is strictly going to be used for that ore. We live in the capital. That's that's our home. That's our fam fam. But we want to use this for uh, securing our iron. I'm also going to need some decent quality rock for that uh, claim. Williams can see to that as well. Peacekeeper Japan has declared war on Inner Circle. Oh, that sucks. War. What is it good for? Absolutely not. Say it again, yeah. Sorry, I like that song. All right, please bring me the clay, sir. I think we only need like 150. Oh, technical difficulties. Come on, Williams. Come on. There you go, boy. Build it. Build it. Build it. And Victor should almost have enough plant fiber. Yep, just takes 150 clay. Perfect. And we need 20 plant fiber, I think. He's getting the right tile, I hope. 67, yep, perfect. Okay. Anything else in this cart? Nope, we're good. Let's see if I can start inspecting for a decent rock pile. Inspect. Still hammering that in. 52, not bad, okay. I could work with that. Worst comes to worst, I could definitely work with that. You know what? Probably won't need more than that 52 right there, but just in case, I'll inspect this tower right here. I'm feeling lucky. I'm feeling lucky. Watch it be one quality. Yeah, no. <laughs> it's like your luck just ran out, buddy. Alright, back to it. Okay, Mr. Williams, if you don't mind, sir, I believe it was this tile right here. Let's see. Need to get a pickaxe out. Got a 71 quality primitive pickaxe, my god. Not so primitive anymore, are ya? Jeez, boy. Alright, dig a tunnel. Forward, please. We'll get. We'll move that wardrobe right after... Uh, you know, I should get the claim up first. Williams? 39 quality. No, that's the wrong tile. So, dig it here instead. Okay, there we go. It should be 52 or something like that. 52, there we go. Okay. Give it to me. Give it to me. Ow! Alright, thank you. Okay, claim land. Oh, right, shape rock. I have a pickaxe? I do not. Hey, Williams. Hey, buddy. 
You have pretty decent materials prepped now. What do you s You know what? I should do this. Hold on. Give me that. And we'll call it square. I have a much higher materials prep than Mr. Williams does. Alright, let's see what we can get. Please be above 50. Should be. My materials prep is 62. What do we get? 50. Oh, okay, even better. <laughs> 59. So I want to claim, like, right here. Our iron mine is basically all this area right here. Yeah, this is all us right here, right? Yep. Okay. That's how far we extend, pretty much. So I'll claim right here. This will give it a good good radius to get the house to. I mean, I'd hope it claim the house to from here. Here we go. Oh, Heavenly Father. I would be thy name. I pray that you bless this land. Let me claim it, oh Father. Oh, Father. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Hey, what? Oh, shiznits. You're a noob. You're a noob. You're a noob. One momento, por favor. <laughs>
Wow, okay. Well, in that case, uh, 48 real days. As you can see, folks, holy crap. How much does this cover? We gotta upgrade this then. Holy moly guacamole. Increase maximum size of private claim to premium subscriptions, 250 tiles. Okay, we'll have to figure that out later. But right now, Mr. Williams, if you'll do the honors, please finish this house for me. Oh yeah, baby. We are about to get stuff done. Oh, we gotta move back. Anticlimatic. Come on, everybody move back. Oh, I was standing in the radius, whoops. You're standing in the radius too, bud. Probably not gonna work. Oh, it is. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Thank you, Williams. Claim it. All Father, hallowed be thy name. Yes. Well, folks, we have a respawn point. Man, freaking tastic. All right, let's see if we can get this wardrobe on the right side of the house. That way it can be within the claim until we can get it upgraded. Are you crazy though? That's 164 game day, or real days it said? That's nuts. Okay, that is nuts. Put it right up against it, if it'll let us. It will let us. Oh, it will. Let's see. Okay, I wanna turn that around. Yep. Yeah. Right there, put it down. As far as it'll go, right there. Yep, that's good. Back. And a little this way. Right there, let's see what that looks like. Perfect. You can barely even see it from the other side. You won't even know it's here. Oh, beautiful. And I believe this is uh, within the claim tiles, hopefully. There's nine tile radius, right? Let me just look at that again though, make sure I'm not crazy. Freaking 789 game days, 164 real days. That is nuts. Okay, we gotta get some God's favor in here. Somehow, some way. Let's see, I have 3,250. How exactly? Oh yeah, by the way, I have a fancy blacksmith outfit, <laughs> as you can see. But guess what? Look at how badass that thing looks. It's not even in the game yet, it's a work in progress. So if you're thinking of buying any of the outfits from the cash shop, um, you'd, you'd probably want to avoid it right now. They're not actually, I don't know if they're in in, in the cash shop right now because uh, I talked to support and they said that they're not, they're a work in progress, they're not in the game right now. So I don't think you can buy it through the shop. But what I did was I actually, since I have a blacksmith outfit, I went in here and it showed it right here. Okay, so I was like, wow, that looks so cool. I've got to get that. So they probably didn't account for people actually going in there and doing that. So they just didn't take it out. Didn't really have to worry about it. But um, yeah, I spent 20 bucks on that. But it's okay. I, I said it's okay because I like I like the way the game is going. I love the direction. I want to support the game. So I don't mind waiting for it. Not to mention that blacksmith outfit looks fan freaking fantastic. They didn't even know this, but red and black is my favorite color. So... Totally down to wait for that. 20 bucks well spent. But um, yeah, you, you probably want to avoid trying to get any of the outfit skins right now until they get those implemented. Just so you know. But um, yeah, how do we get God's favor in here? We're going to have to figure that out. Hmm. I'm sure there's a there's something I can read up on on how to do it, or I'm sure other people would know. But either way, we're going to upgrade that claim. But Mr. Williams, can you come over here really quick? Because we need your help, buddy. That's right. Get that primitive pickaxe out. I'm gonna help you too. I'm gonna get down and dirty with you. Let's go, boy. Give me two pickaxes, please. Let's see. I want... Ooh, 69 quality, I'll take that. And another 71 quality, I will take that as well. Thank you, sir. All right. So we know exactly where to start our mine from. We start from right here, usually. Go ahead and... Dig forward. Right, don't have it on my back. That would explain it. Let's see. 59, 71, there we go. All right. 
First time I've heard a bird call. In this game. In this game. First time. Let's see, Williams, let's get you set up. Dig a tunnel forward. Default action. Okay. Dig it. Ah, we are finally turning that hermit cave into something beautiful, people. I am just ecstatic. Williams, if you could dig that way, please, and thank you, sir. You are a gentleman and a scholar, just like Victor's over there. Hey, Victor, do you want to get in on this, man? I know you got a pickaxe. Come on. Let's go. Let's get your pickaxe on. He's barely used it. Oh, Victor's coming over now, too. Uh-oh. Now it's a party. Can you do three at once? Oh, sucky sucky now. Look who just showed up. We got a celebrity in the house, people. Please be aware. Victor Victor is in the house. Oh my god. Well, alright then. Let's see, dig that way. Keep going, keep going. Triple trouble! Sir! Mining outpost. Alicata. Okay, I'll go in here. Thank you, sir. Keep going, Williams. Let's see, is this leveling up his digging skill as well? Oh, yes, it is. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Not even really that over-encumbered yet. Oh, well, Williams is. Hold on, Williams. Time out for you. Get it, boy. Okay, now what we really need to find is some more 100 quality iron ore. I'm sure there's some in here, but give me one second. Williams is out of commission at the moment. Gotta dump some of this stuff out. Is it dumping? Yep, it is. Thank you, Vicky Vix. See if you can dig that way a little bit more. Okay. Now we got some decent quality stuff here. Okay, Victor, Victor's getting rock right now. see. All right, let's get Williams back in here. What have we got? Oh, you know what? I should bring the card over. Let's see what this is. Seventy-nine quality. Okay. Oh, Victor's is over encumbered. We can dump out the other side too now. Ninety-two. That's what I was looking for. Dump over there. Got to get rid of some of this. Bad quality and medium quality ones, because I'm pretty sure we're going to have some more hundreds in here. Let's see. Okay, we should probably start here. Are these two blocks, see what's ahead here. Mine that out. Alright. Let's just dump out our dirt first, though. Let's see. So, new update as well. I'm at 91 forging right now, which is awesome. I'm almost at 92. I'm like halfway there. And uh, earlier today, I forged some uh, some more steel weapons just to, you know, see how the quality was going to be and for a trade. And uh, I got 68 quality weapons going now, people. That's crazy sauce. I don't even have updated tools yet. So the mining run that I'm making right now, this is going to pay for the, uh, the next set of tools that I get. Which are hopefully going to be really, really tasty. I can't wait for them. But let's see here. Um, um, um... Quality ore is Williams getting? He's getting 83. Okay. And then I'm getting the 70 something, right? Yeah, 75. Okay, perfect. So, Will or Victor, if you wouldn't mind, sir, would you mind bringing the cart over here? Would you be a darling and just uh, bring that thing right over here? Bring that sucker on. So, I think half of this we're going to put in the wardrobe and the other half we're going to bring back with us in the cart. The, the best stuff we'll put in the we'll put in the uh, cart and keep it in there and then the rest we'll just leave in the wardrobe for now. And then wherever we need another uh, iron run, we know exactly where to go to get some decent quality stuff. Victor can make the run on his own for this. This is the start of something new. I'm sorry, I... I break into song too much. <laughs> I can't help it. <laughs> Feels so right. 
<laughs> Don't judge me. That was a great childhood movie, okay? Don't judge me for High School Musical. If you know it, then you're just you're just as at fault, okay? <laughs> if you know what it is, where that song's from. Oh, these things are durable. They are not breaking. Victor, can you inspect that? Tell me what that is at right now. Wait, hold on. Inspect this. If it'll tell you. Hey, William's still got 32% to go through. My God. Oh, he's over encumbered. Yeah. Williams, put that in the cart, please. There we go. Excuse me, Vix. Okay, and I'll, I'm about to be out of room here. Let's see here. So this is the 92 over here. Gotta be some hundred behind here. Please be some hundred behind. Who the fudge is that? Oh, next no, next Aatrox. Okay. Sorry, oh, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he went away really fast. I didn't. I didn't know he was here. I didn't know it was the next Aatrox. I didn't know who it was. Sorry, right, didn't mean to startle you. Probably sees three guys over here, and he's like, "Oh crap! What the hell is going on?" He's like, "Oh my god, we got an invasion! They're tearing our minds apart! Oh my, call everyone! Send the SWAT! Send everyone! The Coast Guard!" Man, this ore is lasting a while. I'm so curious to see what's beyond this. Is he coming over here? Oh, no. He's probably, <laughs> probably gone. Don't worry about what's going on here, man. It's all it's all for, for, for the kingdom, okay? We're just setting up a mining outpost. Nothing to worry about, alright? Nothing fishy here, okay? We're not trying to rob a bank or nothing. Now just calm down. My god, man. Damn, can you believe this, Williams? Oh, here we go. What do we got? What do we got? Please don't be four quality or Son of a... Oh, okay. That's not too bad. 67, okay. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. Alright, not too shabby. Let's see, uh, Victor, would you mind bringing that cart over and filling up the wardrobe, kind sir? If you don't mind, with only the good stuff, we'll dump out the crap. All right now. Let's see, Williams is almost full. I like the progress we're making in this game right now. You know that? I, I love it. I know people have, uh, you know, had some hard times. And I've been there too, all right? I played Mortal, I played Darkfall. Especially Darkfall, you're gonna have some hard ass times in Darkfall. But if there's one thing I know, it's that if you keep at it, no matter what happens to you, you keep at it, you don't succumb to being spawn camp, don't let them spawn camp you, then you're gonna be all right. All right, you're, you're gonna be all right. That's how I feel. Uh, let me see here. Oh, I like how it tells me I just entered a claim that belongs to your friend, Ray Medieval. Yeah, we got a problem. Iron ore can't fit in here. Oh my god, no! Wait a minute. That's a problem indeed. Let's see here. Um, okay. Oh, who's a noob? Who's a noob? I'm a noob. Oh boy. I thought iron ore could fit in wardrobes. Could it fit in Chestin? I don't think it can. Oh man, okay. Uh Williams. Give me your ore. Or wait, go go put your ore up there. What you need to do is put some furnaces up then. And cook it while we're out here. But I don't have my crucible. That's right. I don't have my crucible. So we'll have to use that wardrobe for something else then. Oh, uh, let's see. That's frustrating. Okay, hold on. I'm coming. Slowly but surely. 
Okay, put your highest quality stuff in there. We're gonna drop the rest. 56, yep, dropping that. 62, dropping that. Unless it's superficial bling, we're dropping it. 50, yeah, 58, dropping it. Okay. Alright, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and drop that now. Drop it right here, I guess. Let's see, what do I got on me? Um, yeah, we can get, like, kilns up here now that we have a claim up. We could just use them for storage. I could do that instead. Williams can make the runs. Um, back and forth. I get, like, two kilns up. I do that. I'll do that later, though. I just need a quick, quick iron run. For some good quality ore. Make us, uh... Make us some decent quality tools now. Get us some updated tools. Alright, so what we're gonna do here, I'm gonna put my ore in here. William's gonna keep mining that single block. We're gonna see what's behind that. Six, okay. Six, 75, 83. We're gonna drop that. Okay, keep going, Williams. Drop the rest right here. And we can also always come back and dig this part up later too. So glad I got a personal claim. It's gonna be great when I can tear from the rest of this out. I still, so I can still put the kilns up here. The kilns will be fine. Kilns, couple furnaces will be all good. It's not all lost. And I can just use the wardrobe for like extra crucibles and tongs and whatnot. Anything like that. Let's see. Okay. Cease and desist. What do we got? Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. 79. Okay. I mean, that's decent. Still decent. 89. Okay, this one's almost out, so we'll mine that. 79. And this is the 92, right? Okay, Williams. You mine the 89. I'm gonna mine some of the 92. And we'll go from there. Let's see, what's Williams' inventory looking like? got 140 of 83 quality, 20, 60 quality. Heart. And we have got... What have we got left? 75, 83, 83, 75. Take that 75 out, we'll drop that. Drop it, drop it, drop it. I don't want to see what's behind Williams' uh, block, but... Nah, we can wait on that. We can always wait on that. Not too, too important. We definitely want to drop what's in Victor's inventory. Got 83. Yeah, gotta keep that. 83 quality. Okay. Williams, keep going. Now this is gonna be very high quality stuff. 92. Okay. We're good there. Let's see what uh, what Williams has left on his tile. 89, 12%. Okay. I don't wanna just mine it and see what's behind it. And we'll just deal with the rest in a second here. see. Show me what you're working with. Okay, Williams can't take it. He's overburdened with clay. Go dump. Go dump. Oh, I finished this. Finish that. Fatality. Come on. Okay, empty your clay. Someone's gonna walk back over encumbered. I know that. Because there's no way we're getting rid of this uh, high quality ore. Coming all, it's all coming back. I won't part with a single piece of it. All right, come on back, Williams. Get what you can, take nothing back. Victor, what's your space looking like? 187, okay. We're all gonna be walking back like turtles, but uh, we'll get there eventually, don't worry. Let me look at the tile. Okay, 2%. You grab that, Williams. And then we will see what's cooking. 
Come on, baby. Come on. Show me something. Aha! 69 quality. Oh, come on. Man, I know. Okay, so there's some high quality iron ore on the shores of Ashland, too. I bet you there's going to be some 100 quality in there, too. It's 92 quality. We've got to conserve for sure. But I know this isn't the end. This is not the end. Okay, Victor. I need your help. Please trade me. Come closer. 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 Ha 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 ha. Yes, sir. Take this. And I'm going to get the rest of this 90... Or not the rest, but just get some more 92 quality ore. It takes two iron ingots to make a steel bar. So I'm going to try to get like four or five bars worth. Because I want to get a high quality crucible and a high quality uh, blacksmith hammer. So I have a 71 quality blacksmith hammer. I'm going to use that to hopefully get a higher quality crucible. And I'm going to go from there. Okay. 100 should be good. 100 should be perfectly fine. 69 quality. Okay, yeah. Drop the 69. We'll all get out of here. And I think in the next, uh, the next stage of this will be in the Golden Age. If I do say so myself. This has been a glorious day, folks. Things are definitely looking up. Let's just look at that freaking, uh, statue one more time and see the message that it says. Crazy. 164 real game days, 789 game days. That's nuts. Imagine, I mean, even once it gets past like 30 tiles, I'll still be able to get that upkeep really quickly. So as I said, folks, if you have somebody who's into smelting, if you, uh, you know, you, you want to get a lot of coins, you have a trading post or anything like that, or access to a trading post, this would be a good way to do it. Freaking silver ingots, gold ingots, whatever you got. Copper wasn't giving me that much. I recommend silver and gold, but until then, man just uh just all right folks that is going to be all we have for today i want to thank you all so much for watching thank you very very much for the love and support once again this has been a great day as you can see we've got our outpost up mr williams and freaking victor are ready to go for some more and tomorrow we're gonna be in the golden age baby stay tuned and i will see you guys next time later folks